Welcome to another Facebook Math. This problem, I was scrolling through my social media today, and I saw it, uh, so figured we'd, uh, let's work it out here. This is very similar to the taco and burrito problem, uh, that I will put a link to in the description. Uh, but basically, we've got a couple of food items here that are representing numbers, uh, so we just have to kind of figure out which one, what they represent. So for this top line, we have three drinks. Uh, equaling to 30, and they're all being added together. And so the only way that that could happen uh, would be that if they're all 10, right? That's 10 plus 10 plus 10 equals 30. So the drink equals uh, 10, okay? So then we go to the next line. Using the information that we just know, that we just figured out, we can say that this is 10 plus, and then we've got two burgers. Those uh, burgers are identical. So that's the only way to make this happen would be if the burgers were 5. So the burger has got to be equal to 5. Again, using our information for the next line, we have 5 plus, uh, and then we've got two packs of fries plus two packs of fries. Well, the only way for that to work is if two packs of fries was equal to 2. So that's got to be 5 plus 2 plus 2 to make 9. Now, in this last line is where there's actually the two tricks that, uh, from what I'm looking in the comments, where people tend to make the most mistakes. First of all, notice that it's one fry instead of two fries. So when we're writing this out, this has got to be five plus, but not two. This is one because it's a half of a fry that we got in that last one. And then this is times ten. And then here's the second mistake. We've got to remember our order of operations here. We always multiply before we add. So this is 1 times 10 first, making 10. So this is 5 plus 10, and therefore the answer is 15. All right, thank you for joining me for another Facebook Math. Uh, you can check out my channel if you want to see some more of these. Also, there's uh, algebra, advanced algebra and AP statistics videos uh, for anybody taking any of those math courses. They're uh, available for you to watch. So thank you very much for watching, and I hope you guys have a great day. Bye.